Good. So we got loose leash right now. Got some slack. That's good. Tail's going crazy. So what? Um. Good. 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 Yes. I'm gonna reward. Very good. So what I'm trying to do is get really brief little interactions with the cats. If you can see the cat in there. Um, where hopefully the cats are not pawing at them. They're not running away. They're not enticing the dog or really exciting the dog. Um, puppy in this case. We got Lily here. Come here, girl. Good. Stay in frame. <laughs> yes. So I just want her to be able to be near the cat without feeling like she's got to chase the cat or be scared of the cat, really. So the adrenaline's not going through the roof because that's that's oftentimes yes what's happening this i'm just really rewarding for staying close to me not pulling on the leash um, nothing more than that so we want to uh, prevent the adrenaline rush that happens with most dogs as soon as they see a cat because that's where everything starts all the bad stuff starts right dog chases the cat cat runs away the next time cat expects the dog to chase them so they just run away and then the dog even before they were ready to chase them is chasing them because the cat's running away and it's like this endless uh repeating cycle that's not good for that was not food thank you cat runs away yes no yes so there, Lily did not chase. She got excited, but she didn't pull. She got a little tension on the leash, and that's where I said no. I said no. Give her a little leash pop. Yes. So you see there, when she gets the pop, she comes closer to me, releases the tension, and then I say yes, and I give her food. So no means that's incorrect. That's not what I want you to do. Yes means that is correct. That is what I want you to do. Yes. And here I'm just going to continue to. Does she have an accident? Okay, run, run, run her straight up to the potty zone. Nope. Walk. Nope. Walk. Nope. Good. 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 <clears throat> Anyways, back to the cat. Um, we want short. Yes. Short little interactions where they're not necessarily, they're not touching, you know, the first few times they're not necessarily even within a foot or two. Um, uh, just stay with me. I'll go in there and clean it up. Just, just give me a second. I'll help you get them put away. Nope. Good. Oh, mom's talking to you. Go see. Yes. What? Anyways, this uh, this video got uh, hijacked. <clears throat> but uh, short little interactions. They don't necessarily have to be anything eventful. Could just be puppy walking past the cat. Puppy walking past the cat. Yes. And taking notice and not trying to chase. Not getting super amped up. Not pulling on the leash. We reward for that. Good. So these guys, I'm just... Nope. No puck, no puck, and so I'm no puck correcting just for tension on the leash. No puck, no puck. Okay, stop trying to give her food because they're too close and they're like magnets. They're not gonna not pull. No puck, yes. So there, that time she got a correction, she turned toward me. That's what I want. Yes, very good. Okay, keep her right there. Let's do some stationing. Nope. This will be a great exercise. For these yes for these girls. Good job. Good little leash. Leash. Nope. Good. So we're going to... I left my pal snail because I was doing something. This is a great little exercise. You stay right where you're at. You're doing perfect, right? I saw a kibble in there, so I took a bag and I just did So they need to learn how to be patient and take turns. Good. Ideally, I'd like them to sit, so I'm going to kind of lure into a sit right there. Very good. Good. So... They are, so Lily keeps getting up. This is Lily, this is June. Hey, wait, nope. June? Yep. So I'd like for her to stay in a sit, so she keeps getting up, that's okay. I'm not giving her food until she's in a sit. I can lure her with the food, kind of that way. Good. And so I'm just taking turns, making sure that they're not they're not trying to take food when I'm not offering it to them. They're not trying to bully the other one. And she's just going to miss a turn or two if she's not paying attention to me. She's, I don't know if that's a piece of kibble or not that she has. What you got? Just raise your sharp teeth, huh? Good. So, June's giving me the behavior that I want right now. Nope. Good. So just 
So she keeps getting these little things that fall off the tree. So I'm just giving her a little, little leash pop, telling her no. Good. So they're they're not trying to engage now, which is good. They're not fighting over the food. They're taking turns, so this is good. How much did you need inside? Uh-huh. Yeah. See, kind of like half of that. Okay. Yeah, I had to take a bath. Uh, nope, that was not the right one. Nope. What you got in there? Swallowed already? I was chewing. There you go. She spit it out. Very good. I think they got on Part of the problem is I keep dropping... Pieces of kibble. She does not know. She does not know I took my foot off. Nope. She's a good so just girl. okay. Good we'll see. We'll see how they do sitting this close to each other. You're sitting, so you're gonna get the food. Good. So we'll see how they do. This is a little bit harder. Nope. So I'm just gonna give a little correction there. Nope. Good. Nope. It's her turn. Since you're doing better. Nope. You're gonna wait your turn. Good. That's better. Here's one. Very good. Very good. Very good. <laughs> oh, okay, try not to distract them too much. They're doing fantastic. Oh. Good. This is also a way to feed them their meal a lot slower so that, so they're not choking it down, throwing up because they're eating too fast. Good. So butt hits the ground, so she's going to get a turn now. She missed a couple turns. I think she f is starting to figure out why she's missing turns. Oh, you're standing again. You're going to miss a turn. There's also times where you're doing stuff like this, and it seems like you're not making any progress. Like maybe they're not getting it. They'll get it. Just keep doing it. The next time you do this, you'll see, oh, she's picking this up a lot faster this time. Yeah, sometimes it, the wheels just got to turn. Good. And this, and this is one of several ways that we'll feed their meals. So they don't, don't generally get a whole lot of meals out of the bowl while they're here because we're doing things like this. So I'm giving, you know, anywhere between three to three to 10 kibble each time. So this is just how they're getting their meal. And of course, when they're each eating out of the same bag, we kind of just got to guesstimate because this was Lily's. Nope, 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 yes. Okay. Lily, 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 hey Lily. Oh, hey, I'm, I'm not trying to get him excited. Yeah, now Good. I got you. I dropped another kibble. Yep. Now I'm going to keep the butts. Oh, I'm just going to pat the butts. Nope. 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 Good. So all I want is for her to not be on top of her. She can, she can engage with her. Uh, I probably wouldn't even correct excessive looking right now, just biting, scratching, or being on top. Because those are inappropriate behaviors. She can get that love and affection without doing any of those things. Very good. June still has her attention on me, so she's getting the food. There we go. Good job. And I'm almost out of food here. Got a couple more little servings. And then... We are going to let them potty and get a break. You guys need a break, huh? One, That's it. We're two. out of food. No, it would have been better if you had this Good one girls. too, right? Because <laughs> this Good one's name is you, not that one. All right, let's go potty. <laughs> nope.